Okay, and Deputus is coming back to you, playing a bit of Skyblock on Minecraft. Not a great deal has changed. I've mangled my farming area to get another row of um, another row of those in, another row of reeds, just because I wanted to get some more to make some paper. Probably got enough now. So go, could go back to normal. An Enderman came and stole that block of sand. Very annoyed with him. Um, the mob spawner is going quite well. Uh, if you walk up to the top, you'll notice I've changed it a little bit. I've made this completely enclosed and put a roof on it. But if you go up here, and you have to coming down now. You tend to need a little bit of a shove. Um, you can also see my farm has changed. I'm going to go down there now to have a look at that. I've been breeding sheep frantically. Let's cut this tree down on the way. And I've got one of each colour now. So, just dip into here. Feed the cows. Come on, cows. Keeping these cows well fed. He's not coming. So we've got pink, orange, red, and yellow in this pen. Seems to be a lot more orange than there is anything else, to be quite honest. But I might dye some of these with some dye. Breed some more green ones. Mm. This is my white, grey, black, dark grey pen. Again, you can. Come on, who's breeding? Can't really see them. But yeah, there you go. That is our sheep. There he is, nice and clear now. I've not done anything with the horses, don't need to do them, don't need to use them. So. Today, other than that, I want to be looking at a mushroom farm. Now, I've had some ideas on this, and I'm just going to see if it works. Um, I'm just about to go and have my lunch, so what I'll do is I'll make it, pause the game, go have lunch, and then come back. So. I'll just chop this out and build the uh, mushroom farm here. So when I've got this laid out, I'll come back to you. So we are inside the mushroom house now. Um, you can see I've just built a basic structure. It is inside, six wide by five. I'm going to put the red mushroom there. And I'm going to put the ground mushroom there. Then I'm going to seal it up and hopefully we should get some mushrooms growing. And if I stay close to it, we shouldn't get anything spawning. So I'll place that there to close the door up. And that should be completely sealed now. I'll go stand back inside our little hut. I'll go have my dinner and then I'll come back and see what happens. I wonder how many more of these there is. As you can see, my experience went down. I think you'll notice from last episode. That is the Enderman who stole the sand. He ended up killing me. I wasn't watching what I was doing. And uh, he crept up behind me like Enderman do. Made his funny buzzing sound. And that was the end of me. Quite simply. But hey, you know, we don't dwell on the uh, end of them. So, close the door. I'll stand here for a bit. And then, when we've had dinner, we'll go and check to see if we've got anything grown. Right, we'll see you in a minute. Okay, we're back. Nice and full now. Um, <coughs> let's go and check on... Yeah. Let's go and check on our... 
little friendly mushrooms. There's nothing hiding, is there? Good. So, all been well. It's been about half an hour or so. This should be. Hopefully have some mushrooms in it. So let's grab some, grab some balls. On the off chance that there is. Did I put balls in here? Did I even make any balls yet? I've made the balls yet. So I'll grab some wood. And we will... One, two, three. Grab some mushroom stew, hopefully. That will be nice, won't it? So, you can normally put in a crafting table, two mushrooms, and then you can get your stew that way. But, oh, two red ones. <gasps> Yay, two of each. But, you can also right-click the mushroom and f fill up your bowl. Or not. Um, maybe it's the mushroom. Okay. Well, in that case... Um, it's been a success anyway, we've got mushrooms growing, so I wonder if we should extend that further back. I think I'll take it back another ten. And then let the mushrooms go wild. And we'll check back on that in a few episodes. So yeah, that's exciting stuff there. Um, let's go and kill these mobs and see if we can't get what we're looking for. I'll, I'll come back to you when I kill all these mobs. Well, we didn't get any iron, unfortunately, but I have had an idea, and I think if I take that one out, that one and that one out, spiders should come up and over. Is that a mini zombie? It is a mini zombie. Hello, Mini Zambi. Ah, hello, baby. What's that? What's that? Oh, you're dead. Yeah, so it appears. No spiders coming down. Oh, there's a spider coming now, look. We'll just do that until I've... So let's go up on the top and expand this roof. What happened to the other block? Oh, no. I've got no blocks with me. Oh, what a doofus head. Doofus head. Right. We'll go up onto the top of the roof. And... There it is. Okay, so if I do that and that... Spiders should come, theoretically, over the top when it's full, and then they'll get stuck. And so if I go out with that block, what? Oh, went too close. And then put that across there. Spider should go and get stuck in that, hopefully. He says. If that isn't there, they will. So it should be like a holding pen for spiders. If they go up and over it. We'll soon find out. Because they're really annoying me at the minute. Because they don't come down. So we're still waiting for one more iron before we can shear our sheep. I wonder, out of interest, what will come first? The iron or the breeding sheep? The breeding sheep? The breeding of the sheep. To give us the wool we need. Interesting, I wonder. Put the balls back in there, we don't need them at the minute. I thought you'd right click in the room. I think it's a moosh room that you right click. I think I was mistaken. So, I'm going to put the swords back in the tool chest. 
along with the bows. And let's go and feed some animals. So yeah, I think we're getting pretty close to completing it now. All we need is the gold, which uh, requires a nether portal. So what I'll do is I'll go and feed my animals. And I'll see you next episode, where I will go to the nether and build a platform for pigmen to spawn on. And that can be our pigmen um, killing grounds. So thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed it, as usual, please subscribe, favourite me, and leave me a comment. On the other hand, if you haven't enjoyed it, leave me a comment as to what can do better. Right, thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you next time.